Six years and umpteen lifetimes ago, I shared the story of being struck homeless and how it changed my life. Tonight I'd like to share what's happened to me since then, a journey into love. At 73 years on the planet, how did that happen? My life is awesome. Not for any apparent reason, simply because love has taken over. Capital L love is a frequency, not an emotion. A frequency that is the essence of our very being. A frequency we can activate in our bodies and energy fields. This love is not produced by Hollywood, has nothing to do with romance, and doesn't require a partner. This love resides in and is generated from our own heart centers. This love doesn't care about race, religion, nationality, sexual identity, or socioeconomic status. This love is a higher reality available for the choosing. If you want to know the secrets of the universe, think in terms of energy, frequency, and vibration. Like the planet itself, humans have their own electromagnetic fields and function like transmitting and receiving stations. It's not philosophy, it's physics. We pick up signals from hither and yon and broadcast willy-nilly based on our mood of the moment. Collectively, we can be compared to a choir, each carrying a different note meant to be contributing to the pleasing sound of the whole. But unlike a choir, we do not vibrate in harmony, barely harmonious within our own selves, with the consequences being all the ills we experience as individuals and society as a whole. Now imagine humanity as a single enormous body with each of us individual cells in that body. If we want to illuminate the collective body and create a more loving environment on the planet, we each of us have to light up our own cell. The more love we each generate personally, the more love is generated into the body of humanity and the energetic field of the planet itself. This is what happened to me. The more I loved myself, the more I couldn't help but love others. And the more I love others, the more I experience myself as love. So here I am, loving you. For years, I've handed out hundreds of Valentines on the streets here in Bozeman. The graphic changes, but the message is always the same. You are love. Love yourself. But what does that mean, and how do we do it? It's a very simple process, and I'm going to share with it you. I'm going to share it with you right now. If you like, close your eyes, put your hand on your heart center, take a deep breath, and feel this. I love you, 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 I do. 
I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you, love you, love you, love you, I do. Take a breath. <laughs> you can do anything, baby. With this practice, you activate that frequency, upgrade your personal vibration, and completely change your experience. Because this love frequency transforms everything it touches, and it will transform you if you use it. When we choose to activate the love we are and align with that frequency, we carry it everywhere, we experience it everywhere, we share it with everyone, and we understand that by igniting that love within ourselves, we're contributing that love to the world. I promise you, the more you love yourself, the more you won't be able to help loving others. And the more you love others, the more you experience yourself as love. Try it and see what happens. <laughs>